Don't watch this tutorial if you have time to do concert visuals the right way. This is for when you need results fast. Welcome to the quickest way to create eye-catching concert visuals. Today we're tackling a common problem. Let's say you've got a last minute project and you need to deliver high quality visuals in record time. Because guys, traditional methods like custom 3D scenes or detailed motion graphics are completely off the table when you're on a tight schedule. Now guys, let's face it, as far as concert visuals go, simply playing the music video behind the performer might seem like an easy fix, but it often comes off as really cheap and unprofessional. Why? Because it lacks the dynamic elements and depth that make concert visuals engaging. We need to actually take a different approach that adds visual interest and makes the footage feel unique and actually tailored to the concert performance. This is where a technique that I call relatable footage depth comes in. Instead of just replaying the music video, we enhance it to add depth and make it more visually appealing and visually original. The key is to use familiar footage in a way that feels fresh and integrated with the live performance. Relatable footage depth involves taking footage like a music video and giving it a new layer of visual interest. It's all about adding depth and separation to the footage so it feels less like a recycled video and more like a custom piece designed specifically for the concert. First, we'll be using a tool called the Glass Overlay VFX Pack. You can find the link in the description. This pack helps you transform regular footage into something with more dimension and a polished look. Here's how it works. Import your footage into the After Effects project file that is included with the Glass Overlay Effect download. Then adjust the settings to suit your needs. Next, we're gonna address another common issue. Music videos are usually video edited or cut too fast to simply just use straight as a concert visual. You're gonna to wanna to replace a lot of these fast cuts with longer, smoother shots to keep the audience engaged and not overwhelmed. This is where stock footage comes in. Envato Elements offers a vast library of high quality stock footage, perfect for this purpose. There's a link to Envato Elements in the description where you can find a discount for the first month. You can get the first month for only $9, only through the link in the description. So we're gonna go into Envato Elements now and we're gonna select footage and only footage that complements the theme of your music video, but with longer takes. Import this into your project and use the glass overlay effect for a cohesive look on that stock footage as well. So we've been in After Effects this whole time and we put the glass overlay on some of the stock footage as well as some of the music video footage. We haven't put that glass overlay on all the footage, but we've kept some footage as it is. This kind of creates a dynamic and polished contrast look and I'll leave it to you to figure out how much glass effect you should put on all your footage. I usually do the final arrangement of all this footage in Premiere Pro after I've gotten the glass effects that I want on the footage within After Effects. And that's it. Thanks so much guys.